What's going on, everyone? It's your boy Top Cat the Gamer. We are back with some more Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. So we are tackling this uh, treasure map, trying to find this you know, these lost pieces to this treasure. But we have to fight these fiends in order to get them. And yeah, we just got through fighting the first one, and now we're gonna head on to do the next one. But thank you all for being here. Thank you all for rocking with me. I appreciate everyone, Great as always. Chance. New to the channel and tap the like button. Subscribe if you've not. We're gonna get this show on the road. All right, so. Man, we gotta find some way to heal. Shit. Can I fast travel back over here? Fuck, I guess not. Well, that sucks. Alright. I don't want to go into these fights being completely assed out. So. Got to head back over. I'll try to make this uh quick as possible. Oh shit. Well we get to sleep for free at Johnny's place, but hell if there's another place close, I'll just take it. Um There is not. Good lord, this part of the game where they take your shit away, basically. Like, you can't, you can't fast travel, you can't do much of anything. So, I'm sorry, bear with me on this. <laughs> she say Johnny's always so on. Being completely fair, he's done an awesome job with this uh place so far. Wait, the hell do I sleep here? Oh, I just walk up to the bed. Ah, right, there we go. God, where's the chocobo stop when you need it, huh? All right, let's get it back on the road. I really thought that um, we got more than that up to this point. Yep. Alright, move out the way. <laughs> We're fucking this place up. <laughs> I'm sorry. Just like <laughs> riding by. Sorry. Oh shit! I keep forgetting about that one that's right there. Let me start this. All right. Let's get back on it. All right. So the sh so the map shows this area right here, like this whole. I wish I could move the cursor faster, but it won't let me do it. But it shows this whole area right here, and basically you gotta pinpoint those on the treasure map right here. So we had the first stop. It looked like we just keep heading north. Ah, oh, you see little dolphins in the water. Yeah, see all of a sudden it get dark over here. Alright, so we keep going north here. See it says right there. And there's another piece right here that lets you know you're on the right track. A piece of pirate. Jetsam? I couldn't or Jetsam. Okay. Like it should be over here. 
I think it's just a little mm. Still missed that, damn We need to show up by now I did not think they were going to have a part like this in the game Well, it should be right here, unless it's up here. Yeah, it looks like it's right around here somewhere. Or at least it should be. It like that's the piece right there. about that interesting it got dark again like there was another piece right there they won't let you go there well, I don't know. Interesting. It looked like we were on the right track. That is so cool that you can see the Junon Cannon from over here. They, they did an awesome job on this game, man. I can't wait to see what part three is like when you have the... Uh, The damn high wind. I think there's a bit cut over here. What the hell is that? No, well, nothing over here. Well, I was completely off on this map. Uh, shit, I thought it was like that. Eh, fuck it. We'll find it. Somewhere or another. They really made that thing seem like it was so, so far away from Junon. It's actually not that far. Another port. This is getting shallow as hell. Look at that, man. That is fucking nuts. Look at the high wind, bro. Crazy, man. There's an under Junon. I wonder if we can go in there. Looks like we can, huh? Oop, damn, I ran right to a rock. Hey, we actually can. Look at that. I ain't been back here in a while. How about that? Wait. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh no, nah, no, nah, we do it, bro. Uh, well, yeah, that's back over. 
Okay, they new jump frog. Tell you what, let's let's stick to our guns. What we're doing right now, I will come back to these places. You ready to jet? Why are you going so damn slow at the box? It's actually pretty cool that you can see everything. Look at the condor over of uh, uh, Fort Condor. That's crazy, man. Like being able to see the whole map like this. All those areas I tried to swim to, and the game was like, motherfucker, you can't go over there. <laughs> Now where is this area? This could be the outer one that's all the way over here to the uh, to the, the one all the way to the uh... yeah it's that's definitely got to be it the one that's all the way to the right. All right. So we found that one. Now, where are the other two? That is just weird. Man, this thing looks dangerous. Ooh. Nope. I have moves I need to get for all of them. This is not the party I actually want here. But I had uh things I need to <laughs> giving him that Moogle knuckle. <laughs> that shit sounds ridiculous. <laughs> all right, we the fire, huh? You didn't seem all that tough though. That's right, uh, Blade Burst, that's what it was. I'm through with this on now. Did I have it tied to circle? I thought I did. Enough of you. Shit. Okay. Damn, did you see him catch that shit? That was crazy as hell. I gotta be able to do this. kicked in the face, bitch. I don't understand how many times I had to do that before I finally get it. The proficiency. Like, I hit him with at least like five, six blade beams. It's getting there, but damn.
All right. So basically all these pieces end up being this accessory. It better be good too. If it's something that's trash, I'm gonna be mad. <laughs> Tell you that right now. The monsters are, uh, the, well, the fiends are not all that tough. You just, it's just like you're a kind of regular sub boss. You gotta just kind of stay on their ass and you know heal when you can. Like right now, we're we're not in great shape. Uh, I've been meaning to get rid of all these high potions anyway. Not a huge fan of how the game is just sitting there letting you just see Vincent and uh <laughs> and see it knowing full well like they're not gonna join the party and they are not gonna be playable until the third one. You just know it. That shit sucks, man. Alright. So this is definitely the one that's all the way to the right, right here. Or oh, I could be looking at it wrong. I don't think so, though. Okay, what is the Jetson? It's like pirate jets and what is this it's not on here not on here and it's not an item Not an accessory. I really don't know what the hell the Pirate Jetsam is. I thought it was letting you know you were on the right path. Oh, shit. Well, hold up. Not an outfit. No. Transmuter chips? Is it a material? It's a material. Fragments of an ancient pirate. Ah. So, wow. What is that going to be used for? Maybe be used to make the damn thing, actually. I don't know. We'll figure it out. This map, really, I mean, shit, I thought the map was going to help way more than what it did. Thought I was on the right track, though. I'm at the point now, I'm just, I'm just going to ride around the house, outer rim of the map, and then just go from there. Maybe I'm further up than I thought I was with the uh the first place i went to and maybe i need to come back down to one of these areas or something i, I don't know shit we'll figure it out okay starting to get a little dark and hazy Is that, or is that the game just being like, motherfucker, you going too far? But the fact that it's letting me go over here is, uh... 
Interesting to say the least. They got the outer rim protected with uh, the rocks there. So you can't go too far. Yeah, maybe I was too far up. Okay. And now I'm kind of turning back. Yeah, this went down way, way further than I thought. Wow. Yeah, maybe I was up, maybe I was up near the top up there on that side. I don't know why I thought I saw another ship. Like a broken ship. Eh, my eyes playing tricks on <laughs> Boy, say, give me something. Well, there is... Yeah. Oh, okay, I see an area right there. But I wonder if that's... Gungaga. Yeah. No, that looks like it could be it. Okay, so I was further up. Now I thought I was. Yep. Ah. Okay. So we're going about here. And then something should be right in here. And then that other one was right right there. Interesting. Yeah, I had it way off. Yeah, I guess we can get Regina up over here since the thing keeps telling me I need to go play her. There's the port to Gangaga. Okay. Alright. Let's go over here and, uh. He's just waiting. Look at him. <laughs> He's like, yeah, come on, motherfuckers. Ogre Raider. He's trying to stay behind him right now. Oh yeah, he gonna get work if he gonna inflict enough damage to exploit his elemental weakness and pressure it. Okay, we uh -huh. can do that. Deal with that. Okay, finally we got that mastered. So the thing I love about this one is that she does um, el non-elemental magic when she punches uh, with the other one. Yeah, if you just stay out of his way. Give him the Moogle Knuckle. <laughs> I'm just trying to get him, get him out of the party right now. Okay, so we got that master. Okay, we got all of them now. So now we can go crazy. <laughs> He's out of there.
Alright. Now I can get my real party in here that I want. Case it is fine, it's just it takes them to get used to to play them. Play with them, I mean. The bear being a tank man allows Tifa and uh Cloud to just well on folk. And that provoke, you put that provoke um quartz on him. I'm talking about quartz, but uh that provoke material on him. I play too much trails. All right, I got one more. Thank God he just jumped down that time. So the next one should be around the bend. And then I'll go play Regina and start taking on some of these other. Let's see. Yeah, I can go from there, hit up there, then head back. Man. It should be here. It's a, the map indicates it in some type of way. No, maybe it's a, a little further up than I thought. Yeah. Yeah, that is gonna be uh, further up. My bad. But anyways, we'll go ahead and stop here and and play her. I knew these ports were gonna be uh, used for something. y'all in a little bit green forests are green. since y'all don't want to come and stuff you know yes. still picking up some of these materials as well um now can I I can cool I don't have to go through all the bullshit. All right. Welcome to Gungaga. Did I get everything from you here, Chadley? I assume you saw. I'm keeping a close yeah, must yeah. proceed with care. I did. Okay. I wish you all the best in your ongoing hunt for world intel. Oh, Cisne. There you are. We back. Should probably start getting ready for my rounds in a few minutes. Ah, uh, you're no fun. I need some new dialogue. All right, let's find Regina. Uh. Oh, there's a quest here, too. Uh, inspiration for a children's book. Um, you know what? Not yet. I'm gonna do all this. I want to do all that together. Well, was that it? I think that was the area. Oh, she yeah, she's in here. All right, you ready to get that ass kicked again? My confidence is shaking. Well, come on. You doing this or what? All right. Uh, yeah, let's just go for it. Being completely fair, she's not exactly the badass they make her out to be. And that's no... I'm not trying to shade her. It's like they, they make her make her seem like she's like 
so cold. The, the first time I played it, it was like she was pretty good then, but it's like once you get your better cards and stuff, it's kind of like okay, she's all right. I mean, I've played some people who gave me a way bigger challenge. You know, no diss to her, just being honest. Uh, let's see, I can play that there and go. Yeah, I'll go spaceman in here. And... Oh, I should have played the Choco. I didn't even see it pop up until it's too late. Damn, I fucked that up. Stupid, stupid move. Um, that'll be five there. Um, oh, could it go? Hmm. Yeah, she gonna take that spot whether I want her to or not. So our job is to get the rest of this shit. Three there. I don't think she can change that spot down there, so I want to. I really want to leave that spot and claim these. I can only claim. Yeah, I'm making a, I'm making a strategic play here. <laughs> ah, we got those. Uh, I can take that one back, but I will lose four. Yeah, but it would definitely, it would give me eight there. That's really weird. Hmm. I really just need to stop him from getting the top and, um. Yeah, you know what, I'll say that as. Okay, I'm gonna try this first. That was a good ass play. Good, good, good play. Yeah, I'm mean, not gonna have much of a choice. Could get rid of that one and take over that spot. That'll be three. Oh no. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna do that, actually. Oh, smart play! Damn, he got me on that one. <laughs> good-ass play. I'm talking about her. Oh, yeah, him, but it's her. That's good. That's a good-ass play. Hmm. To play that, but that's not gonna get me anything. I'm gonna pass. Well, that's right, it's not gonna give me a new card. Damn, I should have just played. And she got this one. Oh no, they do give you a new card. Okay. Well, she took it anyway. Eh. Can't I can't fake. I, I talk shit about it and she got me. Good play. No, I could wait. Ah, she gonna give me by one. I could have still won that by points. And she she got one more than me. Okay, she was ready this time. She was like, no, not never again, Cloud. Uh let's see here. It's always hard choosing to play this card. It's really a good card, but it's just you, you get nothing here. That kind of sucks, but I had to try to make it work. Mm. 
but it's such a good card for getting um, added bonuses and everything. Let's see. No, I'm actually gonna save you guys. Ooh, that turned this into a three one already. Hmm. All right. I have an idea. As long as she don't play in that damn middle, I'll be all right. She play in that middle, I'm booked. Don't play in the middle. Don't play in the middle. Good, good. Okay, I'm cool with that. That's fine. Fine. It's a good ass play. Honestly, a really good play. If I can keep her blocked off over there, I'm damn sure gonna do it. Nice. Okay. We got one other spot to play. She playing, she pulling out all the stops. I'll tell you that shit. Um, I think we got her this time. Oh, she, 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 pulled, she coming with the shits, though. Maybe 14. 14 with that one. Well, that one does. Give it up, chick. Give it up. Give it up. All right. Now, that's an ass kicking right there. <laughs> 40. 56, 0. 57, shit. Damn, okay. Now, that's a master ass whooping right there. When you win a lane, receive a score to a bonus 10. Shit. Okay. Come. Let me tell you a story. Once, there lived a queen of peerless beauty and compassion. She loved her people. And they, in turn, loved her. But one day, a change came over the queen. In the blink of an eye, her love turned to hate, her compassion to cruelty. Fair and beauteous though she remained, her heart became black as pitch. Conquest was now her cause, her subjects mere fodder to feed her boundless ambition. And so her kingdom grew as her people perished. Until, that is, a ray of hope appeared. A sorceress who would be their salvation. The Emerald Witch, they called her. And with her arcane powers, she led the people in rebellion, captured the queen, and put her to death. Yet from the Baron's body spilled blood as dark as shadow. And from this wicked Ikor, the myriad fiends of the world were born. And Interesting. That is the story of the Shadow Blood Queen. Some call it a parable, a myth, a fairy tale, and I wish it were. But she is as real as you and I. 
And she is coming. Her resurrection is nigh. You know what must be done. She cannot be allowed to return. She must not reclaim her throne. I pray you will succeed where I so miserably failed. You are our last hope, Cloud. Calling him by name, shit. I await you at the haunted hotel. You must hurry. The hell? Don't mind me. Not been feeling so hot. Hey, Cloud. Do you know anything about the Shadow Blood Queen card? It's the most powerful card in the world. <laughs> Big ass sword. Kind. Though it seems there's a special card that can supposedly counter it. The Emerald Witch. <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> Just forget I said anything. She gasped for it. <laughs> Too many competitions lately. Congratulations, Cloud. You have risen to the rank of Blood Marquis. By the way, I recently received a letter addressed to you. It read, I'll be waiting for you at the hotel in the Gold Saucer from a friendly specter. Are they inviting you to play Queen's Blood with them? I wonder. Mm. Okay. I'll have you know, though. All right. Whatever the fuck time. that was. <laughs> Don't forget to try some of our All right. Uh, let's get back to it. I'm gonna do all the quests in every area. Uh, I'll probably just do a video just dedicating a couple of videos to all of them. All right, so. So I'm trying to look at this. It felt like this thing should have been right up in here with the way the map is looking. It really does, like, cause there's nothing before you get to this area. And it feels like it felt like it should be like all up in here. Let's go again. And they're like maybe this this little island here. Dark over here again. Uh, nothing though. I like, really feel like it should be up in here somewhere. Unless the map is bullshitting. This one? So you look at the map, right? Ah, okay. Okay. Well, maybe it's this one. Maybe it's this area. I'll wrap around it.
Man. Not seeing anything. Ah, there we go. There it is. All right. Well, I'll go ahead and save just in case. All right. Let's kick this last thing's ass and make this thing and see what's going on. Oh, shit. Ooh. I'm gonna hit you from a distance right now. This thing got a lot of uh, attacks, and you get right up close on it. Lightning, really? Okay. Enveloping galvanized flames, it'll unleash powerful counter attacks. That's what it's saying. Ooh. That's not good. Well, Barrett drew his attention, so. People, get your ass out the way. Before you end up dying. Oh, now you want to give it to me. Alright, Barrett, give me something here. This is why I love putting the item stuff on uh, him. Because he doesn't take a um, he doesn't take an ATB bar to do it. All right, nice. Let's get the last piece. Now that one was pretty tough. You have to get in close to him and, and you know to hit him with Cloud and Tifa. If you get some range people though, it should be an easy ass fight. Cause he loves getting close. Well then, we've collected all the lost fragments. Time to reassemble the Pirate King's treasure. All right. Come on. What are you waiting for? All right. All right. There it is. 
Partitions, ATB gauge. I can't even read the shit. <laughs> you booty looting. <laughs> Music is loud as shit right now. Gung-ho as shit right now. You successfully transmuted the ancient king's trusted compass. Pay attention to where it points. Huh. Oh, while selling the high season may lead you to treasure. Yeah, okay. Alright. Now what does this thing do again? Partitions ATB gauge into three segments for a short period after using five types of command. That's actually a pretty beast thing, and I'm actually gonna put that on Yuffie because, well, no, you have to use Renata Refocus for her. Tell you what, I'll see. Or I could use it on Tifa. I'm gonna add it to Yuffie for right now. Yuffie has a, a move coming up. I'll show you um, when I get a chance to anyways. I wanna see if it works like that or would I have to use United Refocus to get three ATB bars. All right. I'll show you real quick what I'm talking about. All right, now we can kind of continue on. Um, not what I wanted to do. Um, no, that's Gungaga. Oh shit, I should have put a pig walk. Let me show you what I'm talking about really quick. Uh, where the hell is that store? Got past it. I think I did. Fuck that bench up. Yeah, it's right here. So, Yuffie has a move as she gets towards the top here. Uh, this move right here, Storm's Fury. 
It costs three ATP. It says only available during United Refocus. I want to know if I could do it getting the three ATB bars or can I get it only using United Refocus, which gives you three ATB bars? Because if I can do it just with this compass, that'll make it a lot easier than having to use United Refocus for her. So that's what I, I was talking about giving to her. She's the only person that needs three ATB bars for one of these moves. I think everybody else is pretty... You know, as long as you um, meet the requirements for it. Now, this one takes two AT bars to do it. Yeah, two ATV bars. I think everybody else is mostly two. Or um, it's uh, some of them are classified as a weapon ability. Like Trinity Strike is a weapon ability. But... Let's see. It consumes, This one just consumes all ATV, so it doesn't matter what it is and hers is the only one that just needs three so that's me why i gave it to her so we'll see how it works out if i only if if i can use it like that if not i guess i'll have to just put it you know refocus and do it like that and then we'll give the item to someone else um i am gonna go ahead and end here i'll take care of some of the little mini games off screen and when we come back we'll do some queen's blood matches and get ready to head over to the gold saucer um I may just go ahead and knock out these quests in the next couple of videos too because when I get over there I really want to just get the whole thing the whole game going and uh get back to the main story uh, so next couple of videos may just be quest stuff and Queen's Blood stuff and so we can just get all of it out the way and then focus on game and then get to the later chapters and hopefully just you know head straight to the end game with it but thank you for all as always new to the channel tap that like button Subscribe if you not, and I will see you all in the next one. Thank y'all, as always. Peace.